Whatever happened to the Segway? Inventor Dean Kamen predicted that it would be to the car what the car was to the horse and buggy. Although, the best way to judge if your idea is any good is to gather feedback from the right people. Unfortunately, Kamen didn't do this. Maybe he was concerned someone would steal his idea. Instead, keeping it secret, only sharing it with possible investors like Steve Jobs and Jeff Bezos. Both of whom were bullish about it, but Bob had no real knowledge in transportation. Jobs called it the most amazing piece of technology since the personal computer. Bezos said, you have a product so revolutionary, you'll have no problem selling it. Investors pumped in $80 million, predicting it will be the fastest company ever to reach $1 billion and become more important than even the internet. Sales were projected at 10,000 a week, but after six years, they had sold only 30,000 units. And after a decade, he was still losing money. Interestingly, industry experts never viewed the Segway as replacement for the car, or at $8,000 a pop being affordable for most consumers. They saw it as a niche product for golf courses, postal services and police departments. Today, many of us are inventing new products and services for the new normal. For us, it's things like printer technology, internet phones and laptop bundles on monthly subscription agreements with everything included. Yes, we all need to move fast, but please take time out and seek industry expertise to make sure your invention doesn't end up on a golf course with a Segway. It begs the question, can creators ever be objective in judging their own ideas?